You really didn't think I was going to make it that easy for you and show you the new bike straight away, did you? Now, I really don't need to give you an explanation as to why I'm putting a new bike on the channel. It's my channel, my money, I can do what I like. But, and as I often say to my partner, it's a big but. I thought it might be fun to keep you all in suspenders just a little bit longer, at least until the video reaches the 8 minute mark. And I assure you, it's got absolutely nothing to do with the fact that at the 8 minute mark, I'm able to put mid-roll adverts in and claw back a little bit of the cash that this channel costs to run. Just so that you know, I don't want you to get the wrong impression. Now, when I was a younger man, I always had to get rid of one bike before I could buy another bike, like most people. I always thought it would be wonderful to have several bikes, but I just didn't have the finances to be able to do it. And indeed, as you get older, you look back at some of the bikes that you used to have, and you have regrets. I'm not sure exactly when it was, but it was probably in my late... 20s and throughout my 30s i used to have this reoccurring dream not the one with carly minogue and the Cars sisters and an industrial sized tin of swarf figa the other dream although i have to admit in both cases with both dreams i would always wake up similarly disappointed and frustrated in the morning no it was the dream about all my old motorcycles that i used to have when i was younger my dad had a large brick built garage and in this dream i would go in there looking for something and i would find several motorcycles covered over by tarpaulins one by one i'd uncover them and they were my favorite bikes from my youth my suzuki gs 850 shaft drive my suzuki gsx 550 es i think the turn of my dream was that sometime in the dim and distant past i'd stored them in there and then forgotten all about them and the dream was about discovering all these bikes again realizing that i still actually had them and as a result of that reoccurring dream i vowed to myself that when i was older and perhaps a little bit better off i would have a collection of bikes and then I started this channel up, which gave me more justification for that 
sort of way of thinking. And then here I am at the ripe old age of 27 and my dream has finally come true. Each year during the running of this channel I've added a new bite to the channel to keep things fresh and add a bit of variety for your viewing pleasure. And this year it had been my intention to get a Norton Atlas. I've been saving my pennies up since last year and then of course Norton announced that there weren't going to be any Norton Atlases until next year so I had to have a rethink. I broke open my piggy bank to see how much money I'd accrued and then I decided to do a little bit of market research. I put a poll up here on YouTube. It was up for a week. I got 2,500 votes or thereabouts. And a staggering 79% of you expressed a wish to see a particular model motorcycle on the channel this year. just trying to get my money's worth out of my smoke machine there and I got my garage door stuck right okay that might not have turned out quite how I'd hoped it had turned out in my head but never let it be said that I don't put the effort in now I had of course intended getting this bike last year but then the whole sort of emergency with the bullets came up so I decided to put it off until another time that being this time it is of course a brand spanking new Royal Enfield Continental GT6 650 in Dr. Mayhem, one of the last Euro 4 versions. So I've got this bike a little bit earlier than I would have intended, but it was a matter of the Euro 4 versions being in short supply. I'm not entirely sure what I've got planned for this bike this year, but rest assured it will feature in the channel prominently throughout the summer. With a full review coming up in due course now once again thank you so much for watching this video and my other videos and in doing so helping to support the channel i really do appreciate it i would also appreciate it if you would leave a like and subscribe to this channel i'll let the music play out to some motorcycle erotica so until next week please if you're riding ride safely and i'll see you soon <laughs>